so we're back. Hopefully now this is a little bit better. Oh god. Oh god, I'm clipping into the plane. Oh god. Already. How are we doing? Yay! We're back. Audio synced. Everything is great. It, you know, it, I think it lost it when the thing jumped from Wii, from the Wii to GameCube. The, uh, the the box flipped out a little bit because of the resolution change. And that was probably the, our our catalyst. <laughs> Can I die before the game starts? Yes. Hey. This gooey paint. Oh god, it's reversed! The C stick is reversed! Take that water pump and clean the airstrip, you. You. Oh, we get voice acting. Power up. Complete. Thank you for purchasing this item from Gad Science Incorporated. Preparing to register customer information. Scanning and classifying subject data. Subject identified as Mario. The little Mario 64 stuff in the bottom right complete. is pretty good. Or bottom I left. Flood, I can tell what it ultra dousing device. I hope to be of assistance. All right. Proceeding with user instruction. All right. Use the R button to shoot. Water Look at this from compressed water. video. If you press oh, the R it's button so bad. all the way down, you can stop and shoot. You can then use the control stick to aim in any direction. Press the X button to switch to the hover nozzle. You can yeah, then time press the e button to hover in the air for a short time. They could have let me do this myself and just had them if talk to me. tank is empty, no water can be sprayed. To refill tank, enter a body of water and press the R button. Instructions complete. Proceed. We do need more e -gad. No! No, absolutely, I don't want to see those again. Mario. Oh god, I just tried using motion control. Oh, this is gonna be a problem. Mario. I tried using motion controls. Mario. Oh no. Look, I've got no issue with the game wanting you to learn the controls, but like, I'm gonna have a real issue today. I actually don't have an issue with the water stuff. I don't like the control for it. I think reversing the C-stick is weird. Oh, that's not for water. Time. Okay, I did it. I did it. I did it. I wish you slowed down a little bit flailing around when you... When you put him in the fire mode. Like, you could control him like a turret. To some degree you can if you hold the L button. Oh, the reverse control is gonna get me. Alright, anyway. I guarantee you sometime tonight I'll get I'll get tripped up by the, the C stick being reversed and I'm gonna die. So 
the uh, the explanation for the Z stick being reversed is pretty straightforward. You're controlling the camera, not the image, and so pressing right makes the camera move right. Quite literally, it goes back to Mario 64 where you were actually controlling a living camera in the hands of Lakitu. Yes, I want to save. Why would I, why would I not want to? Oh, okay, whatever. Um, Device. Is it some sort of pump? I am flood. Glad to meet you. Hey, the police officer has Mario stash. He's been possessed by the Mario hat already. All right, here we go. I like that they only drew that little part of the bars. Court is now in session. As you are no doubt aware. Someone has been senselessly defacing Fair Isle Delfino using some paint-like substance. The accused is charged with polluting our this, beautiful home. This and amount yes, of narrative feels of weird life. in a Mario game. Indeed. How can one not be aware of what is going on? Okay, so I'm going to turn down the game Plaza, audio a little bit. Our poor residents tremble beneath a veil of darkness. All right, I turned it down another notch. Have determined that this darkness Let me know how that is. Risen because all of our guardians, the Shine Sprites, have vanished from their gathering spot at the Shine Gate. The reason? It's quite obvious. This horrible graffiti is to blame. This horrible graffiti. Behold this sketch of the perpetrator based on eyewitness descriptions. The truth is obvious. The guilty party sits among us. Is that it Delfino is member wearing a leather Mario. jacket? Objection! Overruled. I judge the defendant guilty as charged. I hereby order the This is a kangaroo this court. Entire island. Until Isle Delfino is completely free of his vile handiwork, Mario shall not be allowed to leave. Court he looks adjourned. unaffected. He's just sitting there. This appears to be quite a predicament, Mario. Data analysis verifies that the island's inhabitants are indeed troubled by pollution, but the pollution itself is not the main Well, yeah, problem. so, I mean, the shines don't like graffiti. Mario, Who likes graffiti? I don't like graffiti. object at the airstrip, correct? It is a shine sprite. Shine sprites are the source of power on Isle Delfino. They used to gather in great numbers at the shine gate, but the graffiti incident has polluted the island and most of the shine sprites have fled. There is no longer any power to support the peaceful lifestyle I... of the islanders. It is most pitiable. The only way I mean, to I, I'm not concerned that no shine, shine sprite testified because they don't have mouths. Although, to be fair, the only thing that has a mouth on this island is Flood. Is um, I'm more concerned that the speak. court essentially and ruled him guilty Mario after one person talked. And also that this entire Mario society is powered by a bunch of semi-sentient, shiny badges. No, no. Absolutely not. Can't miss the mess, pal. Your first job's to get rid of all that ugliness. And remember, we'll be watching you, pal. The Super we'll Mario Police State. All right, here we go. Let's fight the power. This music feels slightly more, and we've used it a million times in video games since then, but it feels a little bit more uh, active. This is a good remix. Where am I going? Okay, well, we did that. Debsolute. There's a shrine in this guy's house. I'm gonna break into it. No!
Oh, I forgot about that. That's not bad. I keep trying to use motion controls cause Splatoon. This is not an outcome I predicted. Back to highly compressed video. Wow. You know, I'm still trying to get a feel for it. I'm not in love with what this game's doing control-wise. Um, I'm having some issue with the timing of the jump. Did someone just say, make noises at me? He's heading for the square. Get him. Oh, but now he's invincible. It's nice of him to wait for me. Oh no, the blue coins begin. Yeah, I think I, I think the hover cannon is good. I think some of some of the, the physics I remember being really good. I, I'm having a little bit of grief with the with the wall jump. Not the wall jump, the uh, the triple jump. Uh, am I doing something wrong here? There we go. Alright. That's a little un unnerving, seeing him split into a billion little balls. And it's nice to see the return of, like, the episodes in a stage. I liked that. I, you know, it's, it's nostalgic. I don't know that it's actually good or that it adds anything particularly you know impressive to the game i just have some nostalgia for it everybody seems quite unconcerned with the goings on in this place remember collect the 100 coins kids oh jeez i already shot that jump Launching himself in a weird way. <laughs> All right, where's he at? There he is. I like that the trees disappear behind the mob. We splatoon it now. Oh, my God. 
I don't like that I've already had to shoot three piranha plants with water. Like that might seem that might seem minor, but like I know this is a long game. But like I would like to see more variety right out of the game. Especially because it's the same fight. Really, I I'm surprised. I'm surprised that that you would feel this is ten or ten times better than you enjoy it ten times more than three D World. I really thought three D World had a had a sort of charm to its design that sort of superseded the fact that it wasn't trying to ask or wasn't trying to do as much. This is actually my first time playing Sunshine since it came out 15 years ago. I basically marathoned it because, it, as I mentioned on, on the show, it was coming out uh, like right before school started. Like, I think a week before school started. Duffino police are investigating a possible connection. Didn't we already have a conviction? Like, what are we investigating? They've already put a man on trial. Down with PD Piranha. This better not be another Piranha Plant. It's another Piranha Plant. Okay, at least it's not, it's not, okay, it's different. Mario's kind of slow. But that's pretty fun. There is a certain, like, abstractness to the the, uh, the textures on that wall that I kind of appreciate. PD Piranha is over there, so let's get moving. Oh, and the muck's back. Okay, just don't do that. I actually remember this stage. Yeah, I remember this now. Which is probably not good. If I remember it, it's probably not a good thing. I need to get up there, right? Yeah. All right, we up. Camera, no, camera, camera, no. Okay, already. Camera, camera, please. I remember this. Yeah. Now I go up the tower. And I have to jump over. The, yeah. Yeah. Ow. I'm stuck in the wall. I'm stuck in the wall. Not good. Okay. Alright. So... Right away, move to the jet little hover pack. There you go. Alright, cool. Damn it. Yeah, I noticed, Flood. Thank you. You know, I'm not I'm not super surprised they haven't ported Mario Maker to Switch yet. Uh, not least of which, because 
Grab the thing! Come on! Not least of which because they did a, a 3DS port not that long ago. And I wonder if they don't necessarily think there's a bunch of... Like, I, that 3DS port moves some real numbers. Damn it. Alright, well, let's wait it out. Uh, and... Okay. And I wonder if maybe they felt like they had things that they could get money out of more easily, like Mario Kart, that fit more with the multiplayer focus of the Switch. Uh, and, I mean, holy crap, they've made a lot of money on Mario Kart 8 for Switch. Yeah, the 3DS port was bad, but it made them a lot of money. Did I just fly over to him? Oh, no, I can't do that. I can't just steal it from him. Is she wearing a bathing suit? locks you in place, soft click doesn't. There is a disgusting amount of brutality in this fight. Come on, Mario. Also, wait it. Because he's not doing anything right now. I'm just... Like, right now, we're both just waiting for the other person to move. I get that he's the first boss, so they, you know, they gotta take it easy, but like, man. And then he turns to liquid poison, which I then clean up, and I get a shine. That music's pretty solid, though. I'll give it that. All right. What's up next? Does it look kind of dark all of a sudden? I guess that's deliberate. I like that, though. That's a good hint to, like, hey, go look over here. And then these shuffle clocks over here just... Alright, I'll give it a try. How's this for the box breaker? Oh my god, they're invincible. Okay. Uh, let's go look for that thing that they just showed me. Show Toad what he... What he... Why is this island full of toads? Wouldn't you go on if you're if you're the princess? Wouldn't you go on vacation to get away from these little whatevers? All right, Cameron. You and I just need to come to an agreement. Ah, oh, I missed. All right. What we got? Yeah, the water's not bad. Oh, it's one of these. Yeah, the water's not bad. Um, oh. 
Oh, this is gonna be painful. Yeah. 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 No, if this game came out in 2017, you could use uh, loot boxes to expand your your water tank. Oh, damn it. Oh, wait, do I actually have Flood? Hold on, do I have Flood? I thought I didn't have him. I do have Flood. Okay, well that changes some stuff. A little bit. Yeah, I didn't realize I had him, so I, I, I was just letting, my, letting myself fall off the stage. So yeah, this is, this is one of the situations where having played the game before, uh, set the wrong expectation. Also, there's a little bit of, um, I've seen a little bit of Zelda in this, specifically Majora's Mask, not Majora's Mask, um, Wind Waker. Oh, hey, it's a piranha plant. Go figure. Another piranha plant, ladies and gentlemen. And you spray water in his mouth. Oh, this is the teach you what I just figured out a little while ago. You can turret shoot when you hold down the R button. You can click the R button. Alright, there we go. Yay! I bet I get a shine. Will we get a Majora's Mask style Zelda? Uh, I don't know. I mean, the thing, the thing about, the thing about uh, the engine, or the thing about uh, Breath of the Wild, is it's not just the creation of assets and the creation of the engine, like the creation of the world, putting all the pieces together and, and filling it with stuff. Even if you don't have to create a bunch of new art assets, could be tricky. Um, and the testing for that game was immense. And I don't know that they want to run another another round of tests. At the same time, the game's been really successful. Man, everybody's telling me to dial back the game audio. I could take it down again a little bit. Just constantly, like, man, nobody wants to hear sunshine. Alright, dial it back a little bit more. We are way down on the number of notches on the on the game audio now. You, I demand you drown. Drown for my pleasure. All right. I like that's a question mark, even though it's just a coin. I assume because coins just didn't render in this black space very well. Oh, 
Oh, I can't leave? Are you kidding me? Uh, please tell me I can leave over here. I have to walk all the way back. Oh, crap. I'm gonna have to walk all the way back, aren't I? I'm gonna have to walk all the way back, aren't I? Oh, come on, game. <laughs> you fuck. <laughs> you spent your time streaming Mario talking about Blaze Blue? Uh, I can see that. I can see the through line from Super Mario Sunshine to Blaze Blue. All right, let me out. Wait. So I can do a, a spin wall jump and hover nozzle to skip all the platform. Oh, I see what you're saying. I, I see what you're saying. I know how, how Mario works, game. Why is the, uh... The blooper stunned by ink or by water. All right, you need camera. What the what the shit? Not helpful. More underrated sub con or Delfino. I don't know. Now the camera's not gonna let me turn it. I would say Delfino is rated. In the overrated, underrated, I would call Delfino rated. I think Delfino actually gets a pretty decent amount of credit. Shut up, Flood. I know. I just did it. But shut up. Alright. You what? Alright, we're gonna platform. This is what this game is. I actually don't mind the overhelpful uh Navi. Um at least at least I don't mind as much as some people seem to. But like when you're telling me something I just did for the third time you're telling me it, like, shut up. Is there a fence there? I can't tell. There is a fence there, okay. This camera's not helping right now. Alright, punch, yes, jump, yes, okay. No, don't jump side to side, just jump down! <sighs> Let's climb on down. Alright. It is just a matter of time before the C stick being reversed kills me. And that was almost it. Yeah, I did it. Well, there we go, everybody. We did it. We did it. Oh, good. I get to go all the way back. We did a good job. Great. I thought I had I thought I had a uh, flood in this mode. But in fact, I did. Well, it's not like that was a 
totally tedious amount of platforming I just did. Oh, wait. Wait, what? You can't pop it again mid-flight? Son of a... Damn it! Alright. Alright, so we're, we're learning. We're learning from Super Mario Sunshine. It's teaching us things and Mario won't grab ledges. I'm not a fan of that. I didn't... So, hold on. Pause. I did not choose this game for retroactive. Greg Leahy chose this game for retroactive. My immediate response to Greg choosing this... So, we chose it during the break of episode 432. Uh... I actually had a list of games I wanted to put as a poll. And uh, Greg goes, well, you know, it's the 15th anniversary of Mario Sunshine, and everybody's playing Mario Sunshine, and, and Mario Odyssey's coming out soon. Maybe we should do Mario Sunshine. And I thought, well, I'll let Guillaume pick Princess Tomato. And then Guillaume said, basically said something similar, like, well, I got to pick Princess Tomato. Like, I, he... He actually feels guilt about the whole Princess Tomato fiasco. Uh, which he should. Everyone should feel guilt. Uh, but, like... So I let Greg... So I went with Greg's suggestion, and now we're playing Fire Sunshine. And John's already basically posted on Twitter, man, fuck this game. So things are going well. Things are going real well. But remember, you know... We got through Princess Tomato, you and, and, and all of us. We got through it on the stream. Because, you know, I, I'm sure this game is just, just five hours long like that one is, right? Right? Please? Now what? That's not what I thought was going to happen. Yeah, I, I uh, actually would not have picked this game, if, if we're being entirely honest. Wait. No! No! Son of a... Damn it! Yeah, I don't think Sunshine's gonna give us our It's Lisa moment. Alright, I'm already not, not happy with how this is going. To be fair, though, like... I don't have any issue with It's Lisa. I think It's Lisa is probably the highlight of that game. It was nominated with those two bad, or with that good game and the and that bad game. Um, the, so Prime Two was nominated, although there was there was an understanding that I was under no obligation to play it in the event that Prime 2 won, because I've made it clear that of Nintendo's published GameCube games that I played, it's... I actively hate Prime 2. I think Prime 2 is legitimately not a good game. I think it defeats itself at what it's attempting to do in a way that's baffling. Uh, cause Prime 2 sucks, that's why. There's an entire mechanic about making the game not fun to play. And then they built half the game world around it. What if this game about exploration sucked to explore? Well, now we have our answer. Alright, so what dumb bullshit do I need to do? I need to make this thing pop up. Oh, I can raise it higher. I just raised it through the top of the stage, for reference. And then this jackass is in the way of my view, so I can't actually see what I'm doing. Mario, not helpful. All right, we did it. We did it. Come on, grab it, grab it, no! Like, I think, I think the, 
I mean, I, I earnestly believe that the life drain thing in that game is is one of the few times I've played a game where I, I feel like, what? Oh, that's right, the camera goes into the wall. Sometimes it, like, does that. Uh, I feel like it's one of the the strangest decisions I've seen in a game of its ilk. Because it's a game, I mean, it is a series about exploration. In and of itself, like, that is what the Metroid series is about. And they went and said, well, we're going to make it so exploring hurts you. And I get that it's also about upgrades, and there are upgrades to get as a consequence of exploring that make that pain go away. But, like, it made me hate every time I went into the Dark World. Which, if that's half your game, like, dudes, don't make me hate half your game. No, you're right, I should have jumped into the boxes. But then I wouldn't have gotten to get these blue coins. Die. I'm not gonna talk to the Delfino monsters. Fruits. Well, that's just defensive. Alright, so. Hey, here's that, that uh, thing we couldn't open earlier. There's a squid kid in this box. But I can't open it. I have not been shooting all the random birds. I didn't realize I should be. Oh god, he just ripped that, that squid's tentacle off. Like, he just ripped it off. Mario, that's not cool. I actually like Skyward Sword. It's got problems, but like... Like, Skyward Sword has problems, let's be clear. But... And, and actually, we did a... I mean, we did... It wasn't, it wasn't even a retroactive, it was just a regular active. On Skyward Sword when it came out, because we were all playing at the same time. And we were... We weren't... You know, we were pretty negative sounding on it as a whole, but the game is largely okay, it's just got problems. Uh, I thought the world in Skyward Sword kind of sucked, although there were definitely some elements of it that I liked. And, and uh, Mario is dismembering this dude. He's gonna die. Like, he has no tentacles anymore. He's gonna die. Mario is murdering him. Oh, they just grow back. Never mind. All right, rule three, right? Give it, come here, come here, come here. Maybe he shouldn't offer me his tentacle so, so uh, willingly. If he does, I'm just gonna yank him off. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't think, to, to finish the thought, I don't think Skyward Sword's a great game. I think, I think it had some neat ideas. I think it's got the, uh, I think the controls are unfairly maligned in that game. I think what it, what it attempted to do with motion control was, uh, engrossing in a way that motion controls hadn't been up to that point. And so in a lot of ways, it was a good swan song for them as a, as a viable product. Or as the singular focus of the system. Like, Mario just killed that thing. It was just... It was just, like... Here. Why do bloopers... Why do bloopers like shines? 
I demand answers to these fundamental questions of Super Mario Sunshine. I mean, if you just if you just categorically don't like motion controls or don't like motion controls in non-VR games, then yeah, Skyward Sword is just not going to do it for you. I really liked. I really liked them in a handful of games. Um, I thought, even though they were kind of kludgy in Trauma Team, like there was definitely some moments in Trauma Team where the motion controls just sucked. Um, specifically, the endoscope stuff. I thought they added something to that game in kind of a, a, a wonderful, stupid sort of way. All right, I'll give him a shot next time I see one. Um, who? Actually, I have a question. I have an important question. Who moves all these signs around? So Mario leaves, and then somebody comes and puts new signs. Also, it's like Dark Souls. You can see other levels in the in the distance. That's Anne Orlando right there. Anyway, uh, you can submit that to the... Uh, it's like Dark Souls Twitter account. I don't care. I never care. Look at these look at these future Splatoon kids. Like in this angle, like that says everything about Splatoon right there. Look at that. Anyway, alright. That's right, I'm the No. The big daddy of blooper fuck you. Hop on a blooper and give it a whirl. Hang loose, bud. All right, I want, I want this one. The big daddy of Uber surfing. You kidding me? Get that shit out of here. Nope, we're going back. We're going back, ladies and gentlemen. We're going back for that. Oh no! You know, I never got around to... Aw, oh, damn it, it kicks you all the way out? That sucks. I never got around to, to Silent Hill Shattered Memories. And I know, I always meant to. Um, I'll, I'll be honest, I'm kind of a wuss with spooky games. Um, and, and, like, the more spook, the more they, they freak me out. But, like, it's not jump scares. Jump scares are just boring. Um, it's when the game just slowly burns you for a while and then eventually drops something on you that really, I really wuss out. Uh, and to give a good example, uh, my old, my old go, go to, uh, Fractal Dreams, like, just tears at me when I play that game. And that game's all, like, anime and shit, and there's a certain serenity to that game, but... Um, in spite of its serenity, it is really spooky. I don't ever need to play Sonic in the Secret Rings. I, uh, reading that article about how Sonic 06 got made, Mario Miss. Um, and how Sonic in the Secret Rings was like, well, we can't we can't port this game to Wii, so let's just screw it. Let's just make something. And that was the product of I don't know. Let's just make something. I almost have a grudging respect for that game as a consequence of just being something made to fill a spot. The idea that they just said, well. We're here now. Oh, shh. Game over. Yeah, you're right. Before game over. I, I looked down at the chat, and that was what cost me. Continue. Did I lose the blue coin? I at least get to, get to keep the blue coin, right? Oh. Fucking really? All right, so... It doesn't, it doesn't really punish me for dying except making me walk back to the stage. I, is there like a, a quick... No. There's no quick travel. I did get to keep the blue coin. That's the next stage. Where's the one I was just in?
this forbidden speed run tech I'm working on right here. Well, I just I just ruined my world record run of Super Mario Sunshine. Oh, I see. I turn the turn the world into Mario's personal slip and slide. I get it. I just I just thought the image of like the jump slide, jump slide, jump slide is some kind of like tech. It's funny to me for some reason. All right, all right. Always comes in third. Let's do this. Is it isn't most of speedrunning about defying physics? Like when they when you just find weird, dumb, glitchy things to do to make the game go Damn it, Mario! Just go slightly faster. Alright, how many failures am I gonna have before I solve this? We're at one. Start the death counter. I have a good feeling, so we're due at least one more. All right, so we've, we're now past the point of where we screwed up last time. Oh, I can slow it down. Hey, we did it. Watch it not be fast enough. Give me the shine, you jackass. stage? I can't just try again? That's awesome. Like, that's just, that's like a... Like... They could have at least... Yeah, like, let me let me try again. The idea that I have to kill myself in order to not leave the stage is kind of jacked up. Oh, good, I can make the blooper go faster. Well, that's good. So, do, do you know what the time I have to hit for the blooper is to get the shine? First off, you and I need to talk, jackass. You're fucked, and I hate you. 40. I was pretty close. I lost a couple seconds at the start because I uh, fell in the water. Well, I ate the death. <laughs> You're right, this just put you back here. I screwed up. We went with, uh, we went with mint cream this time. Instead of always comes in second. Always comes in second. All right, so we're going back around. 
Okay, we're almost there. Oh, I hope it's not... Okay, it's not... Whew! Alright, we did it. Also, the music hasn't calmed down. The music's still going nuts. This is some baby park shit right now. I don't want your blood money. Waha. I want to make a dolphin mod of Super Mario Sunshine where all Mario's wahas are replaced with something slightly more, like, sultry. <laughs> Going back in, boys. The cage shines bright. Okay. So the guy who moves sh who moves signs has already. D oh God, I remember this one. How close am I to the dumpstery fire shrines? Shines. Oh god, the Pachinko one, I'm like, legitimately going to just cry. The best part about the conversation that happened as we picked Mario Sunshine is that the realization that Pachinko was in our future, like, Greg being the person to float this game, he's also the one who we're finishing up the segment, and I've announced it's Mario Sunshine. And uh, he, he's the one who goes, who makes a, a joke about the pachinko stage. And I think to myself, Greg, this is your fault, bro. You don't get to make jokes about this. It didn't need to be like, wait, why did he fall off? Why did he fall off? What's that shit about? Oh, I remember the Watermelon Festival. Thank you. I'll pass on that for the time being. All right. So, we fell, but it was a meaningless fall. Wait, wait. His record is how far he throws people? Hey, he likes doing it. Even the game knows that's kind of screwed up. I like that the distance varies every time, which is the game's way of saying, look, you're probably gonna try this once and it's not gonna work. Fuck! All right, we saved it, we saved it. That could have been real bad. All right, so far we've almost... All right, that was two saves. I, I really can't rely on that again. Whoa, you again. Like, who says this? I'm ready to throw your ass. Wait. Did I just... Did he just decide to throw me the wrong direction? Is that what that was? Like, did I... 
Did I have any input in that, or was that all just the game? Wait, get up there! Get up there! Fuck! Damn it! Oh my god. So am I even going the right way or do I need to turn around? I don't see any arrows. That's probably not a good sign. I'm gonna try going over there. Delfino Law Enforcement. I'm not looking forward to any of this. I'll be honest. None of this is... What is this? You cannot use it yet. It's only a hologram. Thanks, Dr. Light. We're just gonna walk slowly this way so I don't fall off this platform and I'm sure some dumb bullshit is waiting for me like right there. We got bloopers. We got bloopers. Dumb bullshit confirmed. Up. Nope! Grab it! Grab it. Mario, please. Please. Okay. Okay. We're fine. Grab. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised I needed a second there. I'm surprised Egad isn't in more stuff. Like, the last thing he was in... Look, Pink Gold Peach is a classic. Alright, so I gotta go this way. All in all, I'm not doing as bad as I feared I was going to do. Ow! Can I, can I use this? Yeah. You got the rocket nozzle. Mario. Oh. Oh wait, do I need to use the rocket nozzle or do I just continue on this path? It was better just to take the hit than try to dodge it. Oh, that doesn't do nearly as much as I was hoping for. Oh, God! Okay. All right, we're good. We're good. Everything's fine. like that. Why's it gotta be like that, Mario? Look how far you're gonna make me go back now. Like, I'd almost rather not had the rocket nozzle. Summertime fun. Summertime fun brought to you by Super Mario Sunshine and ready for Nintendo. What shortcut? 
Oh, well, I'm already there now. You mean this island? Oh, I see. No! Damn it, Mario! Why did you run? go? Well, that could have gone better. All of this could have gone better. So, so I went up, and then I went back down. And now we all get to listen to this beat forever. Ah, wonderful beeping. All right. So I, I pressed B on this and he fell. I have to press A. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Everything's fine. And the beeping subsides. Yahoo! All right, hundred shine run. Let's do it. We're not. We're not doing that. Yeah, it's A. Like, I'm not hating this experience. Like, it's not as as, as soul crushing as I was afraid it was gonna be. So far. I said a hundred shine run. Um, but like it definitely could be better. Yeah, the blue the blue shine ones can get out. Like, they don't exist. Come on, Mario, you can do it! You can do it! No, I can't. Alright, that's fine. Oh, there's one of the blue uh, birds you're talking about. I just didn't have a chance to get him. Oh, you're right. I can't. I can spray and jump. Hey, you know, you guys could help. I'm just saying, you guys could help. Fucking toads. All right, here we go. We're going back to the first stage. No, I don't need to tell them about the post. You know how they can find out about the postcard? They can Google the postcard. I can Google the postcard. That's true. Like, I, I saw a little bit of what Giant Bomb is doing with Mario Sunshine. And immediately, like... Okay, I can't kill him like that. I immediately had the thought of like, why do people hire Dan Riker? They've, they've got to know what's going to happen. Like, what motivates you to say, I'm, you know what, no, I'm going to be the one to make Dan Riker work as a, as a functional member of society. And then he's, he's, then he's having Jose Canseco write the forward to his Air Force Gator novel, and he's getting married to Taco Bell. Like, at some point, yeah, like, you're right. There, it, There's a... There's an understanding. Has Toadsworth ever been helpful? No. I'm sure there's some fan fiction somewhere where Toadworth, Toadsworth is the hero. Uh, it's probably, like, PG-13. That bird is just shitting! Sorry, I got distracted. Um, 
Where are we going? That's the wrong way. Where are we going? Cave on the hill. Where's the hill? Where's the cave? Where's the anything? Oh, there it is. Mario Luigi Partners not, not canon. Not in my Mario chronology. Alright, now what? Alright. So we're running low on water, so things are already not going great. Really? That ground was slightly too uneven. Oh, it's frustrating as all hell. All right, so now I have to get. Well, that sucks. Also, I mean, if I had, I, I just cut the, the corner too, too narrow. Like, if I had held the corner a little bit, if I had held a little bit longer, I would have, I would have gotten there. I just cut the corner. That was close. Because I couldn't tell from this this almost flat green texture that that area was slightly more hilly than the area next to it. And that that difference was enough to uh, deny me the, the jump. Grab the, grab the line! Alright. We jump. We, we float. We cave. Lose flood. So the question is, why does the uh, the Spectre Mario give flood back? Why not just keep it? End this adventure immediately. The uh, the physics of the stage that he's landing on that are going sideways kind of freak out a little bit. He lands on one. Oh, this is gonna be confusing. There's a hole there! Damn it! Alright, what's this gonna do? Shoot me out to the start of the stage? Oh, good! <laughs> Shadow Mario wants you to suffer. <laughs> That's fair. Ah, extra lives and one of the nails. Excellent. This weird, like, fake... Fake vocal track. Give me that. Thank you. I'm gonna pound this one. I want this one to have like the poison mushroom in it, just to, just to be a real piece of work. And coin. All right. So, what's the route that's gonna have me do the least blind stuff? Oh boy. Okay. All right. So far. Nothing blind yet. Okay, we good. We make. Jesus, Mario, don't do that again. What's funny is, like, I haven't played a Mario game with a, uh, with Flood in 15 years. But, like, not having Flood now is freaking me out. Also, the fact that get on the nail! Oh, <laughs> 
All right, so this one comes up first. And then there's one right behind it. And there's this one. So I can run across here and I can make. Okay, good. Good. We good. We gonna make it. We gonna make this. We got this. We don't got this. We, we don't got this. We had this, but then we didn't have this. Now we get to be sad. Alright, we're not gonna be sad. We're gonna keep doing this. We are gonna get 10 shines tonight. That's the goal. 10 shines. This is where you do the smash cut to me throwing the controller on the ground at eight shrines and just, just going, fuck it. Get on the nail! Thank you. I'm glad they just give it to you every time. Like, it just comes back. Hoo, hoo, hoo. All right, all right, we're good, we're good, we're good. Everything's fine, everything's fine. We got this. We're back, see? That was quick. Uh, I like platformers, I really do, but for whatever reason, this one freaks me out. It always has. Like, I, 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 I turned my nervousness off just now and I just raced through that stage. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I agree with Kleksoshi that like the the controllers being control being really tight in in 3D land and 3D world is super important because I like the fidelity of saying like I can make these tiny little marginal jumps and I know exactly what I'm going to do. Um it doesn't I just don't quite feel that here. And I'm, like, like I said, I've played this game in since it came out. So like I'm doing this weird adjusting period going back to it. Also, Mario's a little bit fatter in this game. Mario's a tubby boy. Oh, no. No. No, no, no. No. Weird. No. Oh, the red coins. There's red coins. There's blue coins. There's gold coins. It's just coins. It's just coins all day. Oh, red coins. After red coins, is that the last the last normal shine in these stages? Peach fattening him up with all those cakes, yes. Or are there more uh is there another shine behind this one? Alright, what what's this? I already had the hover nozzle. Did, did he just give me the nozzle I already had? There's seven normal shines. So this is the this is the middle shine. They're gonna make me work through the middle shine to get there. All right, that's fine. Oh, I remember these. Like, and then the blue coin pops up somewhere else. Yeah. Mario, please, please. Thank you. That was an extra life, but I'm not going down there to get it. Alright, that's the wrong color coin, Mario. There's six over there. We 
for seven and eight. There's seven. Oh boy. I assume eight is that way. Yeah, I should have seen that coming. That was on me. Yeah, so this is a, uh, this is our, grab the ledge, grab the ledge, thank you. All right. Camera, camera, please. Oh good, he's in, he's in the... Hey, I got a blue coin! How did he end up inside? <laughs> this scab! That's not what I wanted! Why did you do this? Alright, Cloud, fuck you. Mario, what are you? Oh, you're stuck on that. Okay, drop. Camera's definitely having a little trouble. Oh, there's the, uh, there's a blue coin. Camera's definitely having a little trouble keeping up with Mario sometimes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, all right, we got it. We got this. We got this. This is easy. Damn it, I have to go up there now. What's up? Nice! <laughs> he went through the and he made it into the tower. That's or into the sewers. That's kind of cool actually. Alright. Where was it? It was up that way. Yeah, I mean, like, I just... Yeah, I, I just... Cl I, I'm gonna have to go take a look at that. I kinda dig that this game sometimes just clips like crazy. Because I've already had two today where the game just clipped. Well, if you streamed it... did You, you streamed it on Twitch, right? Oh, you forgot to set that to set that to record playback. Oh, that sucks. Oh well. Well, don't worry. I'm sure this game will find new and fanciful ways to break. I just mean you didn't record it like locally. All right, we're full. We full now. How is it that getting back to the shine is the part that's taking you more time than the rest of it? So, not that way. Crap, I forgot how to get up there. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Ma Mario, not... Mario, what? Alright. What? I didn't know he could do that. Grab the line. Alright, you fat Italian stereotype. Listen here. I will give you the little Mac if you don't deal with this. Yeah, I might not be above finding ways to break, to break sunshine. Just grab, just grab it, just grab it. I don't. Like, I know that we got hurt, but that's okay. Is the shine just like directly above me? All right. You you can fuck right off. Uh, 
I didn't expect that to do that. That's not a button I was expecting. Shit! Damn it! Everything's going up Millhouse right now. Alright. We're gonna jump, we're gonna... And I can't wall jump off. Man. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Ugh. All right, we're back. Everything's fine now. Everything is fine. Okay, so... We just gotta watch for the red things. We'll be fine. I'm sure if I hit one, it'll only send me all the way back to the start of this whole platforming adventure. Okay, hey, we did it! Yay! Subpar gaming skill on display. One hundred percent speed run. Here we go. Uh, I'm probably go gonna go. I don't know, another fifteen, twenty minutes. Like I said, I wanted to get, I wanted to get at least ten shines, which we're at nine right now. Um, but I might go one or two more, depending on how fast these come through. Petey Piranha Strikes Back. We're already remixing stuff. You know, just... I I'm definitely going to be on again. In fact, I'll probably only... I'll probably pretty much stream this game exclusively for my playthrough. I just wanted to make sure that all the hardware worked today. Because I hadn't done a Wii game in a while. Or, well, a game game, kind of over. Get this mud shit out of here. Look at that. All clean. I'm curious, Clutch, how many shines or sh shines? How many shines do you have right now? Cleanup's going. We got blue coin siding. Blue coin siding going after it. I'm impressed you got three of those from blues. How many do you need to get a blue, to get a shine out of a blue coin? Oh, so I already have enough to go pick one up. I just don't know where to go get it. bothering to clean this mess up. It's just like... You know... Having these things stop popping up on me would be really nice.
All right, I should probably start looking for Petey Piranha. All right. Where's he at? Not that way. The novel, the novel I already have. But that's okay. All right, arrows. Here we go. All right, so the arrow says go this way. Okay. All right, so we're just gonna go up the hill. So I, uh, when I was thinking about whether or not I wanted to stream this tonight, I was actually running. Which is just awful. And, uh... My immediate thought was, well... No matter what ha He clipped through two distinct surfaces on that fall. That was impressive. My thought was, well, no matter what happens... Like, it can't be worse than what I'm doing right now... As I cramped up somewhere around mile number two. And, uh... You know what? I stand by that. This isn't, this isn't that bad. By comparison. Oh, I didn't need to get up there. Okay, well, I did. I got up there. It happened. So now, so now Klexioji is informing me that the, uh, the blue coin shop actually exists in world and isn't just like a, a like a independent zone that one could, in theory managed to get their way up to, which is impressive and ridiculous. And that is a Zelda, that is a Zelda enemy. Like, I'm sorry, that just did. Like, I know that it's not, like, you know, it's, it's based on a real-life creature, but, like, that's a Zelda, that's a Zelda enemy. Oh god, nothing has a reflection. Neither did the enemy. There we go. That's, that's what we want. Yeah, blue coins. Mario, you seem to be having some problems there. The enemy didn't have a reflection either. What? Chill. It's the bug! Who built this place? Like, it, I know that seems like a weird question to ask, but like... This place is awfully, like... Involved. That's a thing. I'm guessing I can't get over there right now. Alright, Petey Piranha. I already have that around. I guess there's a nozzle somewhere else in this stage you could get. Or they just wanted you to have it just in case you had somehow managed to sequence break the game and get a nozzle you weren't supposed to have right now. I don't know. All I know is that, like, I've really just now beaten back the urge to use motion controls. Which means when I go play Splatoon later, it's going to be a problem. Patiently waiting. Well, they rebuilt the uh, the windmill. Damn it! 
There we go. Oh, that's not where he is. They said he was back. I assumed they meant he was back. But he's not. He is somewhere else. You know, like, I can see where, in some cases, they're doing stuff here that would have been really convoluted and difficult with what they're working with. But there, it's, there's some times that just don't work. Alright, so I can't go over there yet. Jets made him go faster. Oh god, I now that you mention it, yeah, so Klexio should just point it out. Fuck the boats and their water spraying controls, and I just re remembered exactly what he was talking about and didn't feel so good. Wait, where's he at? The arrow is not helping a lot here. This arrow says go that way. This arrow says go this way. This arrow says go this way. None of these are the same direction. He's back in town. He basically, fuck all these arrows. Yeah, uh, the idea of controlling a boat with with the sprayer sounds about as appealing as the lap as uh, appendectomy. I wish I could get like a, a first person view. It helped me establish like a sense of place. Yeah, that was... That was sort of like the biggest perk of getting the nozzle power up just now was that I got my water refilled. J jump. Mar Mario, jump. Please jump. Mario. All right, now you're just sliding. You should stop. Well, we've broken the physics. Well, that sucked. Hit B. Why? Why is it B? Uh, great. It's B. That's 
Thank you, Clark Yoshi. Of course it's me. Why wouldn't it be me? Alright. We're back up top. We're, we're top side. Alright, so... Can't go that way. Can't go this way. And then we just fall. Alright, well, you know. Happens. Alright, we're back. We figured it out. Well, Kutsu Yoshi basically told me how to figure it out. But I'll, I'll take that. A pure victory is better than no victory at all. Death if I fall down there, isn't it? I need to squirt the switch nozzle. They just 
just like slam into the ground. Yeah, it just it just it just shoots down. Oh, I have to jump at him. Not having any health kind of sucks right now. Oh, okay. I have to go now. Coins would be good. So I don't just die. Yeah, I, I'm gonna see if I can dig up some coins to give myself some health. Give myself some health. Give myself some health. Uh, no, there are no coins over here. Well, that's good. Where is he? Oh yeah, now I can aim. You're, yeah, Meow is right, it's because I didn't need water. Alright. I wish you'd sit down. They didn't die. Yeah. Their damage though, so it's may as well have. Yeah. Coins! Hey, we're not 
not gonna die! Never mind! We're totally gonna die! Alright. I have to get back up there. I guess he stopped giving me piranha plants because I can heal from them. Alright. Oh, I can do this. Open up. Open your mouth. Now drop me some coins. Yeah, it's not going so good right now. Like, oh, hey, those little things helping you shoot it down? Well, actually, now they're going to jump on your nozzle when you're trying to shoot it. The sudden and complete lack of piranha plants coming out of the, the muck. Drop some coins, man. Drop a damn coin. Come on. Help me out. I'm, I'm here begging for coins at this point. There we go. Those things, oh, those things disappear almost as soon as they fall. All right, so. 
Situation is now less dire than it was a minute ago. Pron has still got homing muck. All right, that missed, but I, I appreciate that the game helped help me out a little bit. No way they gave me credit for that one. Get up! Damn it! There's like a weird degree of like, you kind of have to just be in the right place at the right time involved in this fight. Did they give it to me now? And there's a lot of like, well, there's a lot of crap going on besides him, so. It's actually kind of hard sometimes to keep track of. There we go. Just open your damn mouth. There we go. All right. Now we just. Hey! It's true, they will go go karting together soon. Except it's gonna be hard to go kart when I just murdered him. Yeah, I don't. I, I, you know, I did. I did make that joke that like this could be the shrine that takes 15 minutes. And sure enough. Waha! Yeah, I do have to wonder, like, how do all these things turn to muck and then come back? It's a little bit disconcerting, to be honest. Alright, um, let's go... It really wants me to go look at the new stage. Uh, let's go find the, uh, the, the blue coin shop. We'll, we'll handle that, and then we'll uh, go maybe open the new stage and then call it. What time is it? Yeah, we can do that. Go! Eat your bananas. It's in the same building as Rico Harbor. Okay. Have I? Oh, it's that one. Okay. I just wanted to do that. So it's over here? Like, tell me that's not the shot from Wind Waker right there. B 
beetle shop. Whoa, what are you... Tanookis? I forgot about these guys. I'll give you one. Yes? No refunds. Just give me the damn sprite. Yeehee. Alright. We now have 11 shine sprites. Which means there's one more and then the game's over, right? 12 total. That's, I, that's what I read somewhere. Mug. I bet I shoot a piranha plant. You know what, Toad? That's a good look for you. Oh, hey, look, a piranha plant. Who'd have thunk it? I'm out of water. I better have to start the whole fucking thing over again, too. Like, this stuff is just tedious. Open. Come. Thank you. Oh good, didn't I was sure I was gonna have to redo all of those. Hey, we did it! Oh, that was miserable. Alright, is Toad rescued? No, oh, I guess I'll clean him off. You better have something good for me. No. Jerk. Alright, what's this stage? What's what what's okay. Gelato Beach. The name is familiar, but I don't remember anything about it, so this should be fun. Oh no! It's this one. 
This is where the bad stage is. This is where the bad stage is. This is where the no one has fun zone is. This is where fun is forbidden. Also, look at these, look at these like monstrosities. I mean, look at that thing. Who designed that? Wait a minute, why do they have a solar panel? I thought they got their power from shrines. Or shines. Game's cannon is inconsistent. Alright. Reflective surfaces are nice, though. Shouldn't Mario be, like, cooking in this? In the middle of a bunch of solar panels? I can't remember what I'm supposed to do. Dune Beach Sandcastle. I don't know what that is. Feel the roots on the beach. Okay. Why doesn't the thing just put the coin where I'm at? Yummers. Yummers. Surf Cabana. Yummers. I like, I like that they can't be bothered. I like that they can't be bothered to figure out how to render all the, the things in the stage, so they just put question marks. Yeah, I just... I remember these things chasing you around and being a real pain in the butt. here. Alright. We're moving again. Alright. Fill all the roots on the beach with water. Alright. You critters need to back off. Oh, these are the smoothie owners, huh? Pinatas and the... Oh, okay. We're gonna go through this. Like, they don't hurt you. They just kinda... Get in the way. Well, that was... Let's get launched this dude. Yeah! Oh, this is gonna get real old. Hey. Bird. Horrible bird monster. Get it. Oh, you can't kill him? Ah. This isn't fun.
Yeah, I know they can't be killed, but it'd be nice to be able to at least, like, incapacitate them. There it is. We got sand. That one didn't even pop up near the, uh, near the target. Oh. Yeah, I can see why these things didn't make much return appearances in the Mario universe. They're kind of obnoxious. Oh, we get to do one of these. Yay. This one's far. Alright. Oh, and it's sand. That's awesome. Alright, so I assume one of these has an extra life. Okay, good. It's the first one I check. Do one of you have an extra life? Probably not. No, coins. Okay, that's fine. No! Damn it! Oh, I knew that was going too easy. The fact that it starts melting as soon as you touch it versus when you stand on it means you can't really afford to have to climb up it. Alright, let's get the extra life. Got it. Yay, okay, so... Woo, that was close. Okay, so let's take a look. Alright, didn't expect the camera to do that. I can't look up, though. Like, I... Alright, there we go. So, climb up the oranges and then jump across is probably the way to handle it. Okay. Oh, they come back. Uh, game, not helpful camera angle here. All right, side jumps weren't what I was going for. Game! Damn it! God. All right, let's turn the camera, because that's probably why the, that block is here. So fix your camera angle. There we go. Yay! What time is it? It's midnight. <sighs> is the next one the awful fruit mission? What is that monstrosity? Is the next stage fruit hell? No? Okay, good. I'll do one more then. Because I, I, I seem to recall there's a mission on this beach where you have to like, um... Like, it's almost like a protect mission. There's just a bunch of stuff happening for a certain amount of time. <laughs> Wouldn't that, like, cook it? <laughs> oh, 
That's fair. No, I mean... Giant caterpillar shows up. My first concern is going to be about a giant bird egg. Alright, so... Let's get a rolling. Jump. Where are we going? Grab it. Grab it. Okay. The sounds of things walking that aren't in view is kind of freaking me out a little bit. Find out what's this way. <laughs> Nothing is that way. Because we just fell. Oh, that takes you up to him, probably. sucks. Mamma mia. And of course I have to go about all the way back up there, don't I? Oh no, I'm outside. So I died outside of a bonus area. I'm outside the stage. I died inside a bonus area. I stay in the stage. I, I don't understand this game. We're just gonna cruise around like this since I run to steam. Ow. Alright, I might need to spend some. What are these two doing? Stop it. It's weird. Now they're mad at me. Durians! God. Come on, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it! Yeah, we did it! <laughs> the underwater sewer stuff is confusing. Go blue coin. Yay. All right. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, this isn't this isn't something I want to do right now. If coconuts are easy because there's coconuts right here. Oh, 
like that they just phase out of reality when they get wet. Put the coconut down, Mario. Put the coconut down. Well, that didn't go so well. Hey, we did it. All right. Oh, it's the blue coin. Like, I appreciate that the work that they put into the, uh, the hub world. Like, there's a lot of stuff going on in Delfino Plaza. In general, there's just fruit on the roof. Uh, in general, like, they put work into the game world. It's just, sometimes I kind of have to wonder why. Oh, I just walked into a cutscene. Stumbled into a cutscene. That is Pina Island. The villain secret hideout must be there. Flood. Giving us all the all the hot tips. Oh, did I just walk into a bad stage? Is this the one where you have to aim while you're on the Ferris wheel? Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Alright, we'll do this one and then we'll call it. Oh, so I wasn't really chasing him so much as I was following him. So the it seems like Shadow Mario is more powerful than anything Bowser's ever really had. Like, he seems to have skill and power that... Yeah, I guess I, guess I really shouldn't put too much thought into it. Get away. Oh, this is the stage on the roller coaster. Oh, boy. That fire effect was not good. That was like fire effect that gif. Why why are we just talking to this guy? Many cutscenes were had on this day. Where? Oh, way back there. Run. 
This is a really, it's really weird to see like a, like a rail shoot, like a literal rail shooter, like, not even like a metaphorical rail shooter, but like a literal, literal rail shooter in a Mario game. We got a bull girl coming from behind. There's one coming from the front. Yeah. Give me a missile. Give me a missile. Give me a missile. Is that it? No. Mario! Yoshi's Safari is a thing. <laughs> but you're not literally on a rail on Yoshi's Safari. Stun silence. You think she'd remember? Yeah, Papa told me all about it. He told me my mama got kidnapped by a bad man named Mario. So you're Bowser's son? So I came here to rescue her. So the graffiti? That was you? This is my magic brush. When I draw with this, all my wishes come true. This is... This is a startling amount. Oh, hey, uh... I forgot that Egad was responsible for this entire fiasco. He said, Mario's a bully, he never fights fair. He said, Junior, you gotta try to outsmart Mario. So I tried to get Mario sent to prison, but they didn't lock him up, and now he came to steal Mama Peach again. You, you pest, stop following us. This is really weird. I don't think I fully appreciated how weird all this this was. All right. It appears to be heading toward Corona Mountain. Well, that was odd. That was really odd in ways I wasn't ready for. All right. Bowser Jr. I actually think like the Bowser Jr. thing, like how that delivery, it was, it was weird and kind of stilted, but appropriately, like it kind of worked. Um, it's still weird as hell. Like th this whole, this whole thing is weird. Everything about this is strange. Like with the balloons is the bad one. Okay. Like, there's something about... I don't know why I went and started on the stage. Like, there's something about the fact that there was a meeting that Shigeru Miyamoto was in where somebody said, like, Bowser Jr. thinks thinks he's Peach's child, kidnaps Peach to save from Mario, and then giant robot in an amusement park. And he went, All right, that's fine. Whoa, camera! F oh, it was—it was the bomb squad. I thought the camera was freaking out before I was even in the stage. Yeah, coins go away really fast. All right, these are haunting. That is a haunting creature. Yes. 
Let me in. Let me in. Mario, I'm very impressed by your jumping skills, but that's not what I was asking you to do here. Stop throwing the bombs at some point. He recognized that Mario's gonna keep doing this crap and just stop. Oh come on! <laughs> the game hurt me off screen. The game actually decided to hurt me off screen. That's kind of impressive. That's like a remarkable just disrespect for the player at that point. Like, nah. Oh no, it's one of these where the stage just vanishes. And I almost walked off the edge of it. Well, that was good. Twice. Okay. Oh, I don't like this already. All right. So where do I need to get to? I need to get across. All right, I can do this. Okay, easy. Easy, easy, easy. Oh god, those things are trampolines. <laughs> oh, you're right, they are just ripped right out of Yoshi's Island. Wow, I didn't even notice that. Mario, 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 stop shifting your foot. Thank you. Dang it. All right, one of these boxes is gonna have the hotness in it. There it is. Is there anything down there? No, it's just it's just a place to go if you fall. Okay. All right, so falling's not a big deal. Mario, Mario, chill, chill out. Ugh. I wish if I didn't press any stick, he kind of just momentum stop so I could recenter it. Alright, we're on. I assume these go in order. Yeah, they do. Okay. Oh. Whew. That's really close. Yeah, first try. Yay. Yahoo! Strolling Stews is a great name. It really is. 14. 14. More than I expected to get tonight. Wait.
It dropped me back in the stage? Was that not the shine? Oh no, this is the can- okay. This isn't the cannon I went into. This is a different cannon that also can get Mario shot out of. Okay. This, I'm back in Duffino Plaza. I was really confused for a second there. Dare we go. Is the next one the red coins? Whoa. Let's go find out. So much coin collection. Over by the strolling stews, huh? Look, look at these monstrosities. Look at this thing. Who designed this? This is a nightmare. All right. Oh, right. This is some interesting music, to say the least. I'm just gonna sit here. Oh, <laughs> just... Mario's just butt just stomped on a kid's head. Alright, so the red coins are this... this... Uh, this away. One. Oh, he just, he just clipped through the boat, ladies and gentlemen. Right through it. Perfect. Alright, we're at two. Good, good, good. That wasn't gonna work. Get on the ledge! Alright. There's a blue coin there. Huh. Come on down, come on down, come on down, come on down, come on down. No, he clipped through the friggin' front of the boat. Alright. I've only got two coins. This isn't this is not a strong start. Alright. We got three. Grab it, grab it. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. There you go. All right. Four. Cool. Cool. No, Mario, no! No! Oh. Dang it. I 
hate the ones that cause it to pop up somewhere else. Yes, sir. Ow, ow. Uh, is the audio freaking out again? Okay, that that might be the time the uh, the indicator that it's time to, to call it. Because the only way to fix the audio, yeah, it may be time to call it then. Because the only way to really fix that is restart the stream and. That's not going to be successful because it's going. I mean, it's going to take a little bit before it's come back up. I'm glad. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Uh, do you have any advice on where the last four coins are? Or am I going to have to platform? Because I'm halfway through. It'd be nice to just finish this set off. <laughs> I don't want to platform in this platformer. No, Mario, no! Oh, they're all above the boats? Uh, there's one. Yeah, I see what you mean. Oh, I can climb this tree. Okay. That's good. That saves me some pain. Yeah, maybe not. But I can't climb this pole. Tree I can climb, pole I can't. I guess they can be more judicious with where they put where they put trees or where they put poles. The game is complete with them, so it would be kinda tough to Make sure you can't sequence break the crap out of the game. Oh! Right off! I'm inside the boat. I'm inside the boat. I'm off the boat. I guess there's no avoiding climbing that thing. All right, we'll give we'll give it a couple minutes, and if I can't pull it off, we'll call it. What the heck? Oh, oh, geez, I broke the physics. I broke the physics. can't get up there. Alright, this isn't going as well as I'd hope. <laughs> Can I do this? Can't climb under. Oh. 
Alright, that's gonna have to do it. Uh, Alright, well, thanks for everybody for coming out and watching me, Mario. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and exit the area. Because I'm gonna go buy that last... Yeah, I, I saw a bird that looked different. And I, I guess that's what you were talking about with the bluebird and stuff. I'm gonna go buy a star or a shine. I keep saying stars. I'm gonna go buy a shine so I can say I got 15 shines on the first day. And oh, I just oh, okay. Oh, oh Mario. Oh Mario. Okay. Dude, this game's camera can get a little wonky in in enclosed spaces, can't it? I do wish there was like a like a quick like quick jump. I guess that guy's on fire. Come here! Where'd he go? He's gone. He's in foot. There he is. I'm trying to help. Slow down. Oh, the dark green pot from up there? Oh, I should have done that. I need to make a mental note of that. But, I did get a blue coin for saving this dude's life. Stop, drop, and roll, kids. Uh, also, terrifying pineapple monsters. I bet there's some really dumb speedrun tech with the belly sliding. Give me your shine. Alright, there we go. 15 shines, one blue coin to spare. Nice. All right, that's it. That was our 100% speed run of Super Mario Sunshine. Everything is done. I haven't missed anything. The game is over. I beat it. Prove me wrong. I see. All right. Thanks for coming out. Night, everybody.